I love this movie. Let me see what you have there. Oh, I would bluff me. <laughs> oh, go ahead and bluff me. <laughs> what would you do? Rod yeah. Carl Malden. Wow. Yeah. Look at how young he is. Yeah. I miss fight card stud. Mm. <laughs> I love that he knows how to shuffle too. In watching this, I wanted to steal like ten lines mm -hmm. you know, that, that they've all said the dead man during this one half hour. Yeah. 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 To raise his role. Hmm. Get back to the crowd. Oh, there he is. OG. Look at those eyes. It's funny you see that and you're like, Daniel Craig's uh, got the same kind of yeah. blue yep. eyes. Wait, that's him? <laughs> <laughs> I've cut the deck. <laughs> mistake, right? Very here. Adam. Oh. 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 So this game is one down, four up, I think, in this half. I think it maybe one down three. Or is it one, one three down. one or one, three, I don't one. remember. Yeah. Oh, it's one three one. I mean, one. I don't yeah. know. I think it's one four in the in this version. Because they talked to the Dr. J. I like that they just show a little mm -hmm. fabric of like a hand with unevent because that's a lot of poker. It's just the little. Yeah. Nothingness things that are happening all the time. They're setting up the floor. Ace to the man. <laughs> Jack Weston, he was in everything for about 30 years. Is that Margaret? Yeah. God, she's wow. Good. That's ripped torn. Jesus. Ripped torn. Oh my God. You recognize him without the beard. God, he's the best. <laughs> He's like Dipper. <laughs> and the string bet now. <laughs> they said no string bet. And they said it too, right? Matter of fact, did he say 2,000? <laughs> I'm here to talk to the audience in case they don't know what's happening. Another string bet. You're 2,000. <laughs> oh, for God. <laughs> Come, let me just bring oh, money yeah, to the yeah. table. <laughs> in the middle of the hand. I tried that today. They didn't let me do it, Phil. So. I know. Yeah, what? I love that. <laughs> of course. Uh, yeah. Like he's too totally. I've got seven filling. I have to fold. <laughs> Sadly. <laughs> he does have that Daniel Craig thing going right, on. Right, yeah. He does. That's interesting. And that was before they had uh, the blue contact lenses. They must flip that down again. God, I love this movie. I don't even wow. understand. At the end, did it. Did, did he, it he folded. So he bet yeah. 2,000 right. and then. Uh, oh, then raised the three on a string bet with uh -huh. his buddy coming in. To and make then, five. Right. And then, the other then guy he folds. Folds. Okay. Right. So he's in for two, but he's folding it. Yeah. I'm not. Uh, I don't want to keep yeah. going. Yeah. Hmm. All right. All right. So uh, this movie uh, brings back, obviously, it's a form of poker that I think a lot of people who, you know, growing up, you probably played this game of poker, but you don't mm -hmm. see a whole lot of it played now. Mm -hmm. um, tell. Tell us a little bit about what style of poker they're playing here and some of the theory of why they're betting. And tell, explain that. Well, I think it's either one down, four up, which I think they played later in the movie. That's why I think that this scene They did. That. They did. Okay, they yeah. did one down, four And that one at the end of the movie was where it was highly unrealistic, where you get to straight flush or whatever. But in this one, the, this uh, was more like yeah. real, you know, the flow. They mm -hmm. showed the first hand where you don't even know what the guys had, and the guy just went like the flow of money. Uh, 
it had an old. I remember seeing this movie when I was a punk little kid, and I thought, oh yeah, cool, you know. It's uh, but I didn't really know anything about gambling, so it still has that. I mean, I don't even play that one down four. I yeah. don't know. It's got it's a, and it's an older movie, so like yeah. I don't know. And then when you're playing this it's style, cool. obviously it's it's very different. Yeah. You know, people who hold them, seeing the whole yeah. cards. The bad card is down. You yeah. you have no idea yeah. what's going right. to be underneath there. Right. But, I mean, the yeah. main thing to bring uh-huh. out of this is that yeah, th- that bringing. I mean, it's so obviously bad that you can't really talk about it because it's a cool all these cool actors, whatever. But the guys coming from the, behind them. <laughs> oh yeah, like, you want to raise them? Hold on, let me. Okay, here's some money right. to raise. Then, oh, okay, now I raised. What? I mean. Well, didn't they say no string bets? Yeah, that's they, all we got. And, then, yeah. and they actually yeah. talked about that. Yeah, they. But you know what I'm thinking? You know, it's a home game, and all home games, a lot of times, they have their own rules. Like some people say, no check raising at this home game. Mm-hmm. So they might, because they're playing such high stakes, they might like when people say, okay, you know what? I'm going to, uh, $3,000, I'm going to raise. They might allow that at this particular game. I'm giving it a little slack because I absolutely love this movie. I always thought it was one of the most realistic depictions of those all-night poker games where people are sleeping on the sofa, sort of the tawdry glamour, the girls standing around their evening gowns, and they'd really rather be anywhere else than watching their men play poker. Uh I love that Carl Malden took all the time to learn how to shuffle. He obviously spent time at poker games. He did the little, the shuffle. He said the yeah. no string bets, which you never, ever, ever hear him. He's taking yeah. out the, 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 the jokers he's, out of the he's deck. He's doing the ch-tung, yeah. ch-tung, ch-tung, ch-tung. I mean, it was, that and, was really tight. Yeah, and I, I just think, I, I absolutely, I love this movie. And I thought, I thought, I think it's fantastic. I would give it. I know we're not at that point yet. Wait, <laughs> let's Let's get to that point. Okay. I would uh, honestly... It's such a good movie. Mm. I would give it. I'd give it a full house for. Uh, I'd give it a full house for poker veracity. Just saying that at home games sometimes anything goes. Sometimes mm. you can you know put more stuff on the table. This is a sixties, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe they didn't realize that you could be weird cheating stuff could happen. And I would say in terms of acting, I would give it quad queen. Wow. Okay. I what love you, this movie. How about for Steve McQueen's blue eyes? Those blue eyes. What that's are those before get? they have the blue contact lenses. I mean, the blue eyes, I would say that's those eyes alone, straight flush. Okay. All right. And Richard, what yeah, are you? Yeah, you know, we were remarking about how much Daniel Craig kind of looks like mm-hmm. Steven, Steve McQueen. Yeah, Daniel you know, Craig in, from in Casino, Casino Royale. 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 The same had that kinda same kinda thing, you know. Mm-hmm. I mean, the cool factor's off the charts here. Uh, I would agree with Jennifer. You know, the poker, I think we can excuse it a little bit because of what it is. As a movie, it's definitely, it's quads. Yeah. I mean, mm-hmm. it's great. Yeah. And there's so much happening in that scene. That scene is actually establishing what's going to happen later on. There. Edward G. Robinson is playing the man, and we see the Steve McQueen's fearless and spoiler alert since the movie came out 50 years right, ago. Right, right, that's yeah. what's going to be his downfall. Yes, but uh-huh. it's so great, and you're so right about Wait, the background stuff. You saw Anne Margaret in the background, but you know, there's somebody right now going, you know, my grandfather was smoking observer in the <laughs> Cincinnati <laughs> kid. You know? Smoking observer. But, I, too, but, I, yeah. but I just I mean, just the factor of all that and the acting is great. And I yeah. love that I love that they I think back in the day there was a little more attention paid to let's pace a movie. Yeah. Because nowadays let's get right to it and here, like the, you know, game. opening the deck of cards, cracking the deck yeah. and all that stuff as you Antonio's mentioned. Antonio's so complaining that. today that the game was too slow. Yeah. I mean he would yeah. really complain if he was yeah. in this yeah. game. Yeah. Uh, that yeah. setting the tone of actual the aura that you kind of develop as you keep going to gambling halls with local ones, whatever it is, that kind of resonates the most fairly and honestly out of mm-hmm. all the poker movies. Maybe Rounders does it too, finds the right chord for like, mm-hmm. wow, this is, because it's a grind and there's mm-hmm. a lot of folding and it's boring and you whatever. You can tell like the girls, kind of they, they, were, yeah. they were a little wilted and yeah. their shoes hurt and they're like, yeah. how much yeah. long do I have to stand yeah. there pretend but like I'm interested? But they were going to yeah. hang out there. This That's is what, what the they're doing for the night. Yeah, yeah. You, I mean, yeah. the guys That's are a great point though because you can almost see like the backstory. Like, I didn't know my life was going to be watching a poker game. I'm all dressed up. And they got suits on. I'm like, really? When are we going out? I thought we were going to the store club. When are we going to someplace? Yeah, or <laughs> something called Shea something. You right. Know? Yeah. Yeah. Steve McQueen, when that movie right. came out, Steve McQueen, you know, he's always been a god in the motorcycle yeah. in the in the whatever, Alcatraz, what was it, to 12 Escape something, whatever in that movie. Happy like, Young was the, the, uh, the Great Escape, of course. Yeah, The Great Escape, yeah, yeah. I'll see him. He's just like the, uh, the, the epitome of cool, and back then the, he like, yeah. 
So every nine year old that saw that movie was like, wow, Steve McQueen. That's gotta learn how to play poker. Yeah. 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 All right. So we got uh, we got quad queens. Uh, I think for the Richard. Yes. What do you think? I, yeah, I think quad tens. It's okay. right there. Yeah, and great, I'm gonna great, go pre flop great. again. I'm gonna go jacks just because I like queens. I like the queen hand better. Okay. I'm gonna stay jacks with it because this is solid and whatever, but. And Jax could really go either way. Because I'm more of a modernist, and Rodgers is more of a modern feel. All right, though. so there you go. That's Cincinnati yeah. Kid with our panel yeah. here. Uh, I think we, we, we liked it. Yeah. Poker Night in America. <laughs> yeah. I actually love watching these scenes. Oh, it's yeah. So I haven't seen that in forever. Yeah.